Oh my gosh. So in numerology, number four represents, wait, hold on. Number four is 13, 22, which 22 is a master number. So if you have 22 on your numerology chart, watch master number 22 because, and watch this one too, because two plus two equals four, four but 22 is a master number. Also 31. So 13 and 31 and 22 all equal four because three plus one and one plus three is four and two plus two is four two. Also, I mean, not two, but also, if you get what I just meant. But anyway, number four, you have a earthy energy that is very, very reliant on fortifying your roots. So, you believe in the physical world and you know that investing in a solid infrastructure is necessary for building a solid foundation. Also, for, for building your own legacy. Which, let me get a number four in my life because I understand that too. And I need... I need one of y'all. I need an eight and a nine for my little structure. I guess that might be my kids and my husband or whatever, but I need a four in my life as well as an eight. Um, you are practical and hardworking and responsible. The vibration of number four is focused on creating logical sy systems that can support scalable growth. So yes, Four, you would really work good with a number eight and a number one. Even though all together, every number is supposed to work together to create something so amazing. But from what I've studied and what I know and stuff, fours will work good with eights and ones. I think we will all make a power team because we go good together. Hold on, I'm making sure I don't miss nothing. I got my notes right here, like always. Um, those are good things about number four. So every number has, it's like on a bad day, in a bad situation. So hold on, let me figure out what y'all is real quick. Um... I have on here something about you guys needing to understand about rules. So it is very important in your life, whatever part of your um, numerology chart that has a four as its, you know, stamp. It's important for you to note that in that situation, rules are meant to enhance an experience, not to inhibit one. So rules give you a guide of where to go and how the, the guidelines to stay within but also it's okay to go outside the box as long as you don't break the rules so it's not to close you in it's just to guide you in a straighter path than if you didn't have any rules so that's something for you to know um, it is easy for a four to become stubborn so it is very important for you to have people in your life that help you loosen up and take risks because it will enhance your um, your experience. So, like I said, having an eight and a one in your life is good. And if you really want to get some experience of risk taking, get you a number five because they ask is I'm gonna put this is for kids, but I just cussed, but I'm still gonna put it's for kids. But fives. If you, if you want to take some real risk and have some type of adventure that involve one of your five senses, get you a five. I'm just going to tell you that right now. Um, it's important for you to also learn how to think outside of the box. Um, you will feel liberated and inspired by finding bravery that comes with you taking risk and if you want to take a bold risk like i said get you a five get you a life path or destiny number expression number heart's desire number five wherever your four is at someone else that has a five in that place 
get you a friend or somebody that got, you know, just, you just gotta be, you just gotta be open enough in the future in the world and stuff. People gotta be open enough and also wise enough and intelligent enough to know their chart to um, ask people. Do you have a five in your numerology chart? And if you're around people who don't know that type of stuff, mm, probably detour from them because they're not hip to the game yet. They ain't hip to the game yet. They still sleep. But really, that's all I have for number four. So number four, you like being grounded, y'all into y'all roots, y'all enhance everything y'all do in a very natural type of way. But you like to play it safe and that is not gonna excite you in the long run. So get you somebody who is gonna help you take risks along your path. And you and a five will go good together because your earthiness will over your you will work good together with a five. Let me just say that. A one, two, not a two. Well maybe a two, but I'm also I'm saying also a one. So a five and a one. Is good for number fours. So wherever four is at in your birth chart, that's what this is. It's for anywhere in your, not your birth chart. Why do I keep saying birth chart? I meant your numerology chart. Wherever a four is at, that is what this video is about. Earthy roots. Roots are the most important thing to anything because without roots, nothing can grow. So. Whenever you get your family or whenever you get your friendships and stuff like that, you are going to be the one probably holding things down. So don't let that overwhelm you and don't let that take away from your happiness because if too much of that happens and like you feel like you are the person holding everything down, it can make you it can make you feel neglected. So don't let don't let people bring you down. Don't let people make you feel neglected. And also keep in mind that if they're not a 4-2, you are the one technically that's meant to hold it down. But yeah, go look at your numerology chart and go look at my other videos for whatever numbers are in your numerology chart.